Hi, welcome back to Colesky Drones. So today we're going to have a look at the Emax Tiny Hawk. So as you can see it comes in this nice little box. So this is the kind of basic version if you want. They do a ready to fly version of this which comes with a controller, more batteries and some spare props. So this is what you get in here. Forget them, it just comes with the one battery and the charger. So that's the battery that it comes with, and it comes with an Emax 450, 80 to 160C, if you believe that, 1S LiPo. You also get a charger, multi-charger, just a simple USB one. Now, what I have found is, so these batteries have always seemed to be in short supply everywhere. These batteries are what you got, what I got with the King Kong, um, I think it was the King Kong Tiny, Tiny 8, I think, or the Tiny 7. Uh, same battery, 450, 85, 160s, same battery. Absolutely fine in this, fit perfectly as you can see. Same connector on the end, so for me it was the right bargain because I had another five of those spare. So that's what I use on them. You also get a mini screwdriver and a new end for the power lead if it burns out. Hopefully it won't. Let's move the box to one side. So this is the drone itself, the quad itself. It's got a fixed position camera. You can't move it. It does have OSD and it does have all the features you'd expect from an Emax product. It has four brushless motors. Now it doesn't come with spare props, so you might be better trying to get, if you want one of these, trying to get hold of some spare props. There's a push on type as you can see, but obviously there's the other way around because they push up rather than so the blades are on upside down if you like. It's really, really flexible. So I can assure you this thing can take an absolute beating. I've got some video footage coming up, it flies absolutely fine outside. I think it was like three or four mile an hour winds, didn't even notice it. Flew well, flies really well indoors. It is the perfect, It's for me it's probably the perfect beginner drone, the perfect beginner quad. I don't think there's anything can get better. So this is the FR Sky version. It has a USB on the top there to connect it to beta flight, as you can see. As I say, I've got mine on this, so let's just bind it up. Let's put the battery in. So as you can see, I have mine set on this switch is to arm, and this switch has my flight modes. So back position I have set up for angle, middle position horizon, air mode and then I have arm on this switch here. I then have lost model alarm buzzer there on that switch. It's not the loudest in the world but it works absolutely fine. So So you can see how stable it is. You can hover it in place quite easily. It's very, very beginner friendly this drone. It really is beginner friendly. You'll see from the video footage coming up that it flies really nice. Bounce straight away to this. Uh, I think I paid around £75 for it. And, uh, and don't get me wrong, I think it's quite expensive with just one battery, but I had the other battery, so they were the bonus for me. But it's absolutely stunning to fly. There's loads of reviews on this and sometimes you think, oh, they might be a bit over the top. It surely can't be that nice. It really is that good. It's a fantastic drone. Perfect starter drone. I don't care who you are. This is a bundle of fun, whether you've been flying for years or whether you're new to it. It really is a bundle of fun and a great drone. Highly recommend this. You're going to see the video footage coming up, filmed from my GoPro and also the video footage filmed from the camera. Have a fantastic day. Thanks ever so much for watching.